Gary, how, how, anything you can say about the difficulty you had with the court case and everything earlier? Um, satisfied with how it all turned out? Yeah, um, everything turned out good. I mean, of course, that's something I, I don't want to put myself in the team in a position like that. Um, so I'm glad everything was handled how it needed to be. You've been dealing with some type of leg issue. I don't know. I mean, has that been frustrating? Do you feel like that will be something you can get healed before we get to training camp? Yeah, um, actually, I feel pretty good now about it. Um, you know, just getting better day by day um, and just focus on the little thing that I need to do to stay better. You feel me? So it's getting better. What's the process been like building chemistry with, with Russell since he's been here? Uh, it's been good, you know, just watching film, um, coming in here earlier and just going over certain plays and certain rock concepts and stuff like that. So it's been a, a, a lot of help. Here with Russ here, what are your expectations for yourself? How, how much have they changed going into this year? Um, you know, I always, you know, just doing better than I did last year, you know, just um, focus on a little thing, little details and just becoming a better player that I was the past two years, you know, and Russ is, Russ coming in and Hackett and all the other guys coming in to just make our offense a better offense. So I'm excited for this year. What's the ceiling for this offense? On um, the ceiling is high, you know, it's going to be a lot of big plays, a lot of um, opportunities and a lot of explosive plays going to be made out there. So it's going to be exciting for real. Jerry, we've had some of those wide receivers, but where, where were you when you found out that, that Russell was coming here and what, you know, what was your kind of initial reaction? Uh, I can't, I think I was, I was home laying down or something. I can't exactly remember what I was doing at that time, but once I seen it, I was just excited, man. I was just ready to hit the field the same day. <laughs> when you have Russell, did, did I guess this last couple of years, did any doubt creep in your mind you can be the player that we saw certainly in college and it, now with Russell, does it give you even more edge and motivation to oh, show yeah. people that? Oh yeah, man, I'm, I'm motivating myself because I know the player I could be and the potential I have. So, and having Russell, it's just going to make me a better player also. So I'm just excited to see how this season go. Tim Patrick was saying that there were a lot of meetings involved with learning this offense and you're trying to do a lot to get up to speed. Um, in the next few weeks, do you guys kind of uh, are you guys going to get together, and what are you going to do in that time to kind of keep keep learning the offense and make sure you're ready to go? Um, basically, just stay in the playbook. You know, just keep learning the little things in the offense that you need to learn, and just staying consistent with that. So, so just during the off season, just give it time, either two, an hour or two, and just go over the plays. You know, so that's basically it. You figure you're going to go back out to San Diego or come here and meet Russ before training camp, you guys? Oh, yeah, for sure, for sure. Why is that so beneficial when you do it in that setting? Uh, it just, you know, you just want that chemistry with the quarterback, um, you know, get, see what he sees out there and tell, you, tell him what I see out there. So, you know, you want that, that relationship on the field and off the field too. Jerry, how, how eager are you to get back in the end zone after last year? Uh, man, I... Uh, I can't wait to touch that paint, man. You know, that's my first time ever playing the game of football and not being able to score the touchdown. But I know I know this year when I when I get in that end zone, y'all gonna feel me. <laughs> Gary, going back to your were you nervous about the court case or nervous you had made a mistake or, or any of that? Or? I mean, uh I wasn't really uh with the situation, I was really nervous because I knew the situation wasn't supposed to be what what to be out there. Um it was a, a petty situation, but I know Good thing everything was cleared up and is out the which at, um, behind me. And I'm just focused on the pat the future. You just on a personal level, did you, did you sort of kind of talk to yourself or say I'm gonna handle situations differently or do any of that? Uh, yeah, you know, just just know how to handle the situation from now on. You know, I learned from it. Um, now I'm just ready to move forward. Last year, when you had that high ankle sprain, at what point coming back from it did you feel like you were finally 100%? Uh, as soon as I got back, I felt like I was good. I mean, at playing a game of football, as soon as you step the first day of practice, you're never 100%. So as soon as I got back and was able to run, I felt I felt good. There was no limitation, no nothing. With, with the touchdowns, do you think this offense, this style, puts you in a better position to potentially get some of those opportunities? Uh, most, most certainly. I mean, Coach Hacking um, and Russ is going to do a good job to put us in the best position possible to uh, be successful in this offense. So, yeah, I feel I feel that 100. percent What kind of relationship do you and, and Russ have beyond football? Just as friends, teammates, etc. Uh, we got a good relationship. You know, just getting to know each other a little bit more. You know, um, not not much really. We just be hanging out sometimes. Not nothing major for real. What do you like about him? Uh, just how motivated and just how 
hungry he is. You know, he always keeps me motivated. Uh, he's a great leader, a great guy. Um, yeah. You know KJ as well as anyone. You, what do you think about him in terms of returning? Should we expect him back when the season starts? Oh yeah, for sure. Uh, I think KJ looked good out here doing little individuals, doing some of his running. You know, he just wanted to get back to that 100%. But he looking, he looked pretty good to me out here. So yeah, I'm excited for him to get back.